Well, Gainesville firefighters trying to determine what caused the fire that claimed the life of an 84 year old woman. Loved ones tell Fox 5's Portia Bruner that the woman who lived there had a terrible hoarding problem, and investigators confirm that the huge piles in her condo made it difficult for firefighters to find her body. Authorities here in Gainesville say Alice Faye Law had so many belongings inside of her condominium. This place was condemned just last week. The door wouldn't even open halfway when they first got here. So that's our guys had to take the doors off of the hinges to be able to make access to get inside. Gainesville Fire Division Chief Keith Smith says his firefighters had a lot more than just flames to fight when they arrived at the second story condominium of Alice Faye Law early Monday morning. He showed us the large pile of clothing, boxes, and other belongings firefighters had to move just to get inside the condo. You can't effectively search because the, the mounds of stuff that's in an apartment throws your search off, not to mention you got to check every hole. That's what unfortunately makes a delay in locating anybody. She was only within about 15 feet of the front door but on the other side of a lot of items that are piled up. We knew this was going to happen. We asked her not to come back. Petula Howard says her great aunt has been hoarding items since she moved to Gainesville from New York 18 years ago. She says loved ones would clean up the place only to watch in frustration as Miss Law buy more and more belongings. Authorities condemned the 84 year old's condominium just last week and had the power disconnected. If you know a hoarder, do something. Do something. They're not, most of the time, they're not going to let you help them. Or, but then if you don't, this is what's going to happen. Even more heartbreaking, loved ones tell me they had just made arrangements for Miss Law to get the mental help that she needed and even move her into a nursing home. All of that, they say, was supposed to happen today. From Gainesville and Hall County, Portia Bruner, Fox 5 News.